Hey guys, Smarty here. From the channel Smartest Stranger. In this video, we are going to be looking at What is a signal? Types of signals. Difference between the analog signals and digital signal. First we look at what is a signal. A signal is a physical quantity that conveys information. Audible speech is certainly a kind of signal, as it conveys the information of one person to another through the physical medium of sound. In electrical term, we can say that a signal is an electromagnetic or electrical current that is used for carrying data from one system or network to another. Types of signals Basically, there are two types of signals. Analog signal. Digital signal. Analog signal is a continuous signal in which one time varying quantity represents another time based variable. These kinds of signals are current, voltage, pressure, flow, human voice, light and etc. In instrumentation and control, Normally we use 0 to 20 milliamp, 4 to 20 milliamp, 0 to 10 volt, and etc. signal for input and output control. We can divide analog signal into two parts. Analog input signal. Analog output signal. Analog input signal. In analog input signal, Sensor sense the physical quantity and convert into electrical signal. Transmitter converts the signal into standard 4 to 20 milliamp, 0 10 volt, 0 20 milliamp, and etc. Analog input module converts the signal into digital form for further processing using ADC. PLC takes the input via its input modules and execute it according to programmed instruction saved in PLC slash DCS. There are different sensors uses in industry, some of them are Pressure sensor Flow sensor Level sensor Vibration probes Temperature sensor Potentiometers and etc. Analog output signal. In analog output, PLC or any controller execute the programmed instruction and give the command to output. In analog output module, DAC converts the control signal to 4 to 20 milliamp, 0 to 10 volt, and etc. Again and control the output motorized valve, VFD speed. Different outputs include motor speed control for VFD, motorized valve, and etc. Digital signal. Digital signals are not continuous, these signals are discrete in value and time. These signals are represented by binary numbers 0 or 1, on or off. For a module of 24 VDC, 0 VDC acts as off state, binary 0, and 24 VDC acts as on state, binary 1. We can divide digital signal into two parts. Digital input signal. Digital output signal. Digital input signal digital input mean discrete value, on slash off, from any sensor, different sensors includes, limit switch, switches and push buttons, proximity sensors, photoelectric sensors, condition sensors, digital output signal digital outputs are binary numbers, 0 or 1, from the PLC. It is a processed control output from the PLC to the field. It is used to on or off any piece of field equipment. Digital output is like a contact of a relay when the pre-programmed conditions are satisfied the contacts are closed. 
digital output can be used to operate solenoid valves, relays, indicating lamps, motorized valve, alarm, or as a command to any other devices. Difference between the analog signals and digital signals. Analog signal. Digital signal. Denoted by sine waves. Denoted by square waves. Uses continuous range of values to represent information uses discrete values to represent information. Analog hardware is not flexible. Digital hardware is flexible in implementation. The analog signal bandwidth is low. Bandwidth of digital signal is high. Analog signals are more accurate than digital signals. Digital signals are less accurate. Analog signals take time to be stored. Digital signals can be easily stored. Analog signals are difficult to get analyzed at first. Digital signals are easy to analyze. So guys, this is a basic overview of electrical signals. For more informative videos, follow us on YouTube. Thanks for watching.